Welcome back to the channel guys, episode 45 of the Danish Youth Academy Challenge. And today we're in the round of 16 in the Champions League. We've got Newcastle, very hard draw. I suppose it could have been slightly worse. We could have got Real Madrid or Man City on the other side. But if we do go through, I think we play against Girona or AZ. So if we get through this, there's a real chance we might be in the semi-final. We've been in Newcastle before. Let's have a look at our past meetings. So we have played them twice in the Champions League phase. We've never played them in the knockout round, but we've drawn... And we've won. Now, we was at home both times, so that's slightly unfair on Newcastle. But we have got the upper hand slightly on the head-to-head. -head. So let's get into the first game. We are away from home in the first leg, so I'm going to go down to balanced. Positive is a bit too aggressive away from home against these sort of teams. Had a look at Newcastle's team. It's very, very good. It's old, but it's good. Um, so this is the team. Yeah, Ahmed in goal, Kofwed, Agad, Elahav and Kuchuk. Shimoan in front of the back four. Drexel's on the right wing because Jakobsen is injured, as you can see there at well, you can't see, actually. He's there, uh, but he has got a slight injury next to him, which you can't see. So Drexel's on the right wing, Gartenman and Topol, centre midfielder, Argerson on left wing, and then Rasmussen, the main man, the top scorer, the talisman, is up front. Here we go then, Newcastle playing a 4-2-3-1, which started off quite well. Two shots, 79% possession the first 10 minutes. Hoping we can keep that up. They've got a very good team, like I said. I know all their strikers, their attackers, they're very, very good. I also know that their Greek centre defensive midfielder there is also very, very good. So this is going to be a very tough one. Gartenman's injured. Corner for them. Hewison, world-class right winger, by the way. Taking it. Back to him. That's the Greek guy. And that's Astori. And that's Jimenez. Oof. They are fifth in the Premier League, I think, Newcastle. So they're not the best team. But they are very good. Now, I'm going to go back up to positive. Because balanced isn't doing us any favours. It's all them. Back up to positive, like I said. Let's see if we can get something from that. Highlight then started. I'll take the pressing down as well, guys, on the defensive line. It was a bit too high, I think. So that's all going down. Then we were pressing a bit too far. Too high up the pitch. Uh, I don't like my right winger being there. This is nice build-up from them. We can nick it somewhere down here, though. There. No. Maybe there. No. No. Yeah, there it is. That's the overload because Drexel doesn't know what he's doing. And that's the corner. That's the cutback. And that is Gorski. As you can see, worth 200 million. 23-year-old Polish striker. Absolutely world-class. I don't think there's going to be much we can do against these. I'm going to try and keep it down to one goal. If we can, 2-1, 3-2, maybe even 1-0 even like this. And then try and win at home. Just don't think there's going to be much we can do, guys. These teams are too strong. Our... Yeah, there you go. That's second goal. Is he offside, maybe? Philippe Delforge? Yeah, it's a goal. All right. It's offside, isn't it? Sure it is. He put his flag up. He had his flag up, I'm sure. Yeah, he did. Thank you. Whew. Okay, so maybe the 4 one 4 one's not working for this one. Maybe we go to a 4-2-3-1. Uh, it's all them, isn't it? We're getting battered. So we are going to go with this, which is, again, 4 one two. I'm going to go there, and Gartenman can go there. I think that is the right thing to do. Argerson will be a winger. Drexel will also be a winger. And we'll go with that. It's just been all them. The momentum, as you can see, there is all them. We had two shots in the first five seconds, and then that was it from then on. Just a constant, constant barrage of attacks from Newcastle. Yeah, They're, they're very, very good, aren't they? Keeping us penned in. This guy here, their captain, Hauka, he is very, very good. I'm going to show you him at half time. He's what gets everything ticking for them. Right, half time. And you know what? I am going to say I'm disappointed. We're at home, we're away from home, but I don't care. So if I go to, like I showed you, this guy, Hacker. Yeah, 32 year old, like I said, they're quite old, but look at this, 19 off the ball, 19 flair, 19 leadership, 18 vision, 18 passing, 19 composure, just literally one of the best players you'll see in FM, and he's been there for so many seasons, uh, yeah, just gets them ticking, very, very annoying, isn't it? So, let's see if we can get something from the second half, even if it's just 1-0, like I said, if we can keep it 1-0, I'm fine with that. Uh, we could go down to positive, though. It's a, this is a tough one, isn't it? This is a very tough one. It's going to be a different game at home right now. We are struggling. I just think there's a big gap to these teams right now, isn't there? There's a big gap. I don't think we can do anything about it. 
They've got the press on. We can't get away from the press. They're too good. Like, there you go. The press in. We can't get out of it. Can we? Can we get out of it? Is this on? Is this out of it? Is this out of the press? It's not. Look, they're there. He's reading it. I wonder what this guy's anticipation is because he's won the ball back a couple of times. Can we win that back? There. Yes, we can. Topple. Can we make advantage of it? Go on, Drexel. Go on, Drexel. Agerson. Agerson. Come on. One more. That is a massive, massive goal. Right. Jakobsen can go on this right wing. Gartenman can come off for Lindbergh. God, what a goal. Agerson at the back post, by the way. Six foot four. Comes in handy quite a lot, that does. Partly why I've got the right winger sat as a winger. Because uh, they go down the wing, cross it in. Big guy back post. This is a big FM in, isn't it? One shot on target. They've had ten shots on target. It's all them. Can we? Oh my god, there's no chance. Surely not. Oh, we've given it away. We've given it away, lads. What have we done? What have we done? Put it back. Lindbergh. Topple. Agerson. Oh no. Oh, imagine. Imagine we would have scored that. Oh, that was a big, big chance. Good save from their goalkeeper though. Hen Enrico. I don't know how good he is. Oh, this is cruel. This is cruel. I don't really either have a left left back because my left back is very, very tired. Uh, do we bring on Nielsen at left back? I think we do. Oppel, Shimoen, what do we take off here? Do we take... I've not got much, guys, have I? I've not got much. Everyone's nervous. Just going to see if we can... Hold on. Yeah, it's, this is a struggle, isn't it? This is, this is bad. This is hard. Oh, why would you go there? What a save. Why would that guy play that ball there? It's a corner. Right. I'm going to go back. To the four one four one, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to take off a right back for Lin Scow. I'm going to take off a DM for Vindau. In fact, we'll grab us some bear. Vindau, I think that's five subs. So I'm hoping. Hoping here that we keep out this attack, and this is going to be a way to sort of keep them out and uh, and win the game. Well, draw the game. Sorry. Right, we do that. We do that. We do that. We do that. We do keep the tempo. No, we'll we'll do that. That's fine. And that is sort of. What I would like us to do. Now they just need to hope that they don't score this. Just need to hope that they don't score this. Please, that be the end of the highlight. That would be fantastic. Brilliant. Right, now, hopefully that should be it. Lockdown. Wow. Unbelievable result. Didn't deserve it. They've absolutely battered us. But we've gone to St. James's Park and we've got a 1-1. That is amazing. Guys. I'm going back in a second with the second leg. Here we are then with the second leg. We're playing a 4 1 4 1. I've gone back to it because we're quite strong with that formation at home. And like I said last time, I think this game is going to be a lot different. We should be a lot better. Now, obviously, they're still going to have their chances because they've got world class players. But I'm expecting a bit more chances. We're a bit more even at home. Uh, it's just if we can ever pinch a result away. And we did it. So this is a very good chance to get into the quarter final. Right, here we go. Throw in for them. Left back to Jimenez. I don't like this. A good save. Ahmed, by the way, is taking over now from Jess Kersh. He's better than him. So uh, I don't think Ahmed can get much better. Though. I do need a goalkeeper. I do need like a top goalkeeper. 
you know, one that's going to keep us in games. I know last game, obviously, Ahmed did really well, but uh, and, and he's a world-class goalkeeper. Well, just slightly less than world-class. For example, how good's their goalkeeper? Yeah, I mean, that would be nice, <laughs> wouldn't it? 18 agility, 17 reflexes, 18 decision-making. He is very, very good. He's a bit like Edison in real life, isn't he, from Flamengo. 57 million bargain. Chelsea winning West Ham 2-0. Come on, guys. We're sure we can do better than this. Started the game quite well, but we've ended the first half not very good, have we? Um, right. So, again, I'm going to say it's not acceptable. We're not playing well. Disappointed. Disappointed. I'm going to take off Jakobsen. I know he wasn't going to play the whole game today, but... He's done okay in the first half. Not amazing, but okay. Drexel is playing the second half. One shot on target for us. 59% possession. So it's suggesting we've got the ball, but we can't break through, which is, again, what's probably going to be showing you here. Jensen is playing because Gartenman is suspended. Go on, Drexel. That's a great cross. Rasmussen there, but fantastic block from Del Forge. I think this guy must have, like, 20 anticipation. This long hair guy is pretty much like a... I mean, his second name suggests he's Belgian. Right, he's probably like a, a Belgian Maldini. He's everywhere. Let's have a look at him. Yeah, he's Belgian. 18 anticipation, 18 positioning. Yeah, not bad. <laughs> not bad at all. Jesus, this team. We are playing. Is he, is he Iranian? Yeah, he is. Oh, they're just brilliant, aren't they? Every single one of their players, man. Tough. Now, what can we do here? So... Good, yeah, top all. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, it's nice. On Drexel. On Crawford. Jensen. On Jensen. I like that. Rasmussen. Oh! Thought maybe, guys, that was it. Maybe. Okay, we've... Uh, played much better now. Rasmussen up front on a 6.2. It's probably because he's not got much help, to be totally honest. Come on. Can we take the ball off him here? It was a mistake in the first leg that led to our goal, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. It was a mistake that nearly led to the second goal that we nearly scored. That is a fantastic pass from Gorski, their striker. This is not good. Oh, what a good shot. That's their left back, isn't it? Inverted wing back. Let's have a look at him. Oh, my God. 20 decision making. What have we got here? Have we got something we can do? Jensen's tired. We could put Limberg on. Stopping for Topol. Now you can be box to box. Left back. We could put Nielsen on. Make him a full back. Just lock down that wing. The defensive infielder is on a 6.4. I've not got anything on the bench. We are struggling for a bit for bench players. Again, as you can see, we've been slightly better this game. But I still think it's going to be them that wins this. Yeah. We just can't. That's it. Okay, that's nice. Yeah. Rasmussen. Oh, that's a bad pass, Rasmussen. Okay, he's won the ball back, our guard. Mm. Oh, my God. Nielsen. Whoa, what's Nielsen doing? Topple. Topple. Put it across. Rasmussen. Oh, he blocked it. How did he block that? Is it just because they're elite defenders? There's no way this is their highlight. Surely not. Oh, what a block from their player that is. I thought we'd scored. I thought we were going to score there. Really did. Extra time. Or oh, maybe not. Maybe not. 92nd minute. First goal of the season. 92nd minute. Guys, that is devastating. That is absolutely devastating. The first goal of the season. He, he has to have like 18 jumping. Rising like that. 17, 6 foot 3. That is cruel. That is cruel, guys. That is it. Again, we can't get through to the quarterfinals again. So, that is the first time that maybe I'm thinking in Europe we need a different formation. Now, I've got a lot of good results with that formation in the past. This year as well, this FM. But I might have to change it. Maybe the 4-2-3-1 
would help, potentially. I might maybe retrain someone to play DM, play two DMs. Rasmussen signed a new contract as well, by the way, 55 grand a week. He signed it for four years and an optional three years, so that's what, seven years? So he'll be 28 by the time that's ended. We can hopefully time down as well for the end of his career after that. But guys, that's going to be it. Thank you for watching. We are out again in the round of 16. Next episode will be the youth intake. I'll show you the preview as well. Leave a like on the video. Leave a comment in the comment section below. Leave a subscription on the channel as well. That would be amazing. Until next time, as always, I'll catch you then. Goodbye.